Hello friends and welcome to Friday Night Files. And we are back after a longer vacation abroad. We are finally back making videos daily again. Tonight we are playing a game called Crypta FM. You can play it for free. You can find it on Steam. And there's not really any kind of description for the game. But what I do know is that it's an atmospheric indie horror game. That's what we are all about. So without further ado, let's press start and check it out. Okay. So yeah, this is a Polish game. We have to listen to this radio. I have no clue about the controls. <laughs> Interaction, blah, 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 blah. Flashlight Q. Uh, okay. Skip the broadcast. Mamy 10 minut po 21. Mam więc zaszczyt powitać serdecznie wszystkich słuchaczy Radia Bożygród w audycji Krypta F. Krypta FM. Okay, so there's some radio broadcast going on. Dziś przedstawię naszym młodszym słuchaczom kilka wskazówek dla początkujących łowców kryptyd. Oh, so we are cryptid hunter, eh? I guess. Posłuchajcie. Yeah, let's listen up. Why did I get rid of... ...of the flashlight? Camera flashlight change E. Okay. Aha, I see. Two, two seconds, you guys can't read all of the subtitles. I'll move myself up here. Because unless you're... Unless you're Polish, you won't understand a thing <laughs> without the subtitles. I Oh, someone killed his goat. Poor goat. And the chickens too? Oh. Is our door locked? <laughs> Hopefully it is. It's an old ass computer. I think this is in 1990s or something. Yeah? <laughs> Oczywiście przydałoby się więcej informacji. Dlatego też apeluję, jeśli mieszkacie w Gondarach, bądź macie jakiekolwiek informacje, które mogą pomóc w śledztwie redakcji Krypta FM, zapraszam do kontaktu telefonicznego podczas jutrzejszej... Maybe we can call in if we find some cryptids. Bądź i tutaj ciekawostka technologiczna. Zapraszam na nowo powstałe forum internetowe audycji Krypta. Yeah, so that's why we can use the computer. Znajdziecie na portalu internetowym naszego radia. www.pozygrod.fm www.pl Moi drodzy słuchacze, to jest oczywiście temat, który zdecydowanie warto pozostawić dorosłym. Jednakże, tak jak obiecałem, dla was również dziś coś przygotowałem. Spisałem kilka porad dla młodego. We have to listen to this, you know? Now we get the tips. Na pewno przydadzą wam się podczas własnego śledztwa, które przeprowadzić możecie na własnym podwórku. Oto one. Po pierwsze.
pierwsze, zaopatrzcie się w dziennik, w którym będziecie prowadzić swoje zapiski. Okay. I think we have a journal. To tylko połowa pracy kryptozoologa. Przed wyruszeniem w teren warto wiedzieć, czego w ogóle szukamy. W dzienniku zapisujcie więc konkretne zadania. Takie jak odwiedzenie konkretnego miejsca, które warto zbadać. Jeśli chodzi o pomysły na zadania, dobrym źródłem może być na przykład nasza audycja, jak również nasze forum internetowe. Okay, we'll check the forum. Druga zasada, trzymajcie się ścieżek. Szukanie krypty to Stick to the past. sposób Noted. na spędzenie wolnego czasu na świeżym powietrzu. Jednak pamiętajmy o zdrowym rozsądku. Oddalając się od domu, warto mieć ze sobą mapę okolicy, na której zaznaczycie we have a map as well? Pomocne mogą być również punkty orientacyjne. W ten sposób, tak długo jak zostaniecie na ścieżkach, zawsze wrócicie do domu. I trzecia zasada, najważniejsza. Powinna wam zawsze towarzyszyć osoba dorosła. Are we an adult? I don't know. Jest najważniejsza. Badać zjawisk paranormalnych. Paranormalnych. Jego hobby towarzyszy wiele niebezpieczeństw. Eksplorując opuszczony budynek, łatwo skręcić sobie kostkę. A, a nasze lasy mm, pełne są pokrzyw i koczastych krzewów. O, w towarzystwie osoby dorosłej zawsze będziecie bezpieczni. Are you, all, are you though? Are you always safe with an adult? Na naszym forum Krypta FM. Ja nazywam się Łukasz Bartyniuk, a to była Krypta FM. Do usłyszenia jutro o tej samej porze. Udany chłopów. Thank you. All right, we have a journal. Out cold corpse at neighbors. That's what we know. I guess we're going to outside and visit our neighbor. But first, let's check out this forum. How do we interact with stuff? F? Okay. Ta-da! So we have... Is this like... Is this Windows 7 or Windows Vista? Something like that? Photos. No naked women? Okay. Malloy, what's this? As this paint, wallpapers, we don't have any. We can play Barry the Beaver. Oh, conductor, what's this? Okay, maybe we'll find some discs around. I don't know. Okay, we can go to the internet. Welcome to the broadcast official website. Feel free to join the discussion on the forum. That is the main page. I have no clue what this says. Forum. Was in the photo lover 14's gallery. We don't have any photos yet. Okay, let's read some of these forum stuff. Oh, it's gonna be a lot of reading, yeah? God damn it. A weird observation in Kostari. It's gonna be a reading simulator a little bit. But we'll get to the to the interesting part when we go out. Which you know what? We can always come back and read this, right? Right? Let's go out first. Can I sleep? Before I go sleep, I have to upload photos on the forum. Yep. First of all, we'll go out. And do some exploring, you know. See if we find any cryptids. I like this old style graphics, you know. It's pretty cool. We have a map. Oh, okay. It's not easy to see. Oh, okay. Good, good, good. So where is our neighbor? Is that a question? We have two question marks. Villages, head, cemetery. What's that X? Let's go right and check that X with that lightning bolt. We have to start somewhere, right? Out of here, do I get out of here?
Are we getting out? Can't interact with the gate. Uh, okay. Can we get out from the back? Maybe? Uh, we have a hole in the fence here. And we have to be quick to get the camera out if we see any cryptids. So I guess this is the neighbor that called in to Crypto FM because here's his goat. Do we take a photo of the goat? Yeah. Cool dude. So that was our first objective. Maybe we should just go home because we can't get out from here and upload that photo to the forum and then read some of the forum posts, right? Uh, Internet adventure. So can I? Upload a photo. I don't know. Back. Can I? Maybe not. Okay, I can join the forum here. Can I reply or anything? No. What does our journal say? It didn't say anything, right? No. Okay. So there's like no tutorial to this game. <laughs> but it's a free game, so I can't expect that much. Okay, these are emails that we don't have. How do I upload? Photos. Photo viewer. Tab. Maybe. Let's try and press tab. See what happens. Nothing. Oh, here we go. Didn't we take a photo? Why do we... Why don't we have a photo? I don't know. Camera okay, one, sprint, interaction. Doesn't say how to change page or anything on, on this thing. Now we took all those. Do you go back out? Try and take another photo. Or is that some paranormal shit going on? What the hell? Let's try it again. Now we have a photo. Got a photo of the goat. Awesome stuff. See if we can go in and upload it now. Or something. Maybe that was the wrong forum page, yeah? We're on. There's nothing here in my gallery. Doesn't say anything about upload photos or anything here. Okay, let's read some of this. So I guess this is Lucas Bortiniuk. That was the Crypt FM host, right? I would like to present to you the discovery that was made near Costari. 
of which you may have already heard of in today's Crypto FM broadcast on Radio Bosigrot. The local community began to encounter the remains of bitten animals and slight damage to vegetation. Places where wounded animals were found, one could see strange scratches on trees, broken bushes and branches lying on the ground, as well as trampled grass and smaller vegetation. And there probably wouldn't be anything all that unusual about it were it not for the eyewitness accounts of Gostar residents who report encounters. With a strange creature that has been seen in the area for some time, it seems to be connected to the mystery of the mutilated animals, as well as the destruction in their vicinity. I immediately point out that nothing happened to any person, but the victims of the creature happened to be farm animals. As Mr. Yetshe Svirgil said in the news, I butchered that. In contrast, I learned from one of the residents that, that our mentioned creature moves on four legs and resembles a medium or large dog. His head seems to be completely black with prominent white fangs and an almost glowing pair of eyes that stand out. The creature also supposedly has pointed ears which can also deceptively resemble horns. So it is difficult to determine what exactly they are. Despite the stature, which can cause fear, the creature is rather emaci- never heard this word before. It's rather emaciated. Some even say that he can be injured or stained with blood of previous victims. It discovered it is covered with a thick coat, especially around the head and on the elongated tail. These are incredible information, but I renew my appeal. If you live in Kostari or you have any information that can help in the investigation, please contact us by phone in the tomorrow's live broadcast. We post this information on the forum. How can I post? I want to post my picture. You know? I should be... Can I upload pictures from my camera and onto here? Uh, I don't know. Photos. Here we go. Oh, I did get the first photo. Upload. Alright. We upload that photo, but where did we upload it to? Here? Picture of a dead goat found in Kostari. Hello, referring to the audition, this is the photo of the dead goat found in the village of Kostari. Alright, so I think we... We have uploaded this to the forum now. I suppose. I don't know. So let's read all this. As promised, I posted a guide in text form. First, provide yourself. Okay, we read all. We heard all this in in the radio broadcast. How to turn into. So, if you're expecting to find any helpful replies for posts with such a title, then from this day on, you will be met with nothing but disappointment. It's now forbidden to ask how to turn yourself into a vampire, werewolf, mermaid, or whatever, whatever else you'll ask. Okay, those are mythical creatures that do not exist in the real world, and no matter how much knowledge from the world you might have, you will never be able to turn yourself into one. So, if any topint your blessing upon USC. Like that comes up on the forum again, you'll get a warning and your post will be deleted. You can all go away now. <laughs> yeah, I like that this has... You know, people are spelling and writing as they would in real life. More or less. You are our Lady Freya. Here, Isis or Great Timida. 
Glory to the admin team of the forum. Lead us through the darkness of our mere lives. Us stumbling mortals to the light and immortal life. Let your knowledge build. This is just, you know, no reason to read this. Okay, so this gaming console has been acting up. Cool, cool. These are some alien stuff, I guess. You can read all this if you want. I want to explore more of the game before delving deep into all these these things. So I guess we have uploaded this, so what now what? Let's find out. Is our journal updated with anything? No? Uh, can I go to sleep? Can we go to sleep, I guess? Maybe someone... Someone replied to our, our photo. Gotta check if anyone commented on my posts. Yeah. Okay, I guess... Huh? What? Did you guys see that? If not, rewind the video. Is that a cryptid? I only saw it for a split second. Maybe he'll talk about our photo, our post. That's we, that's us. Hello? Victoria. Witam cię, Victoria. Z czym dzisiaj do nas dzwonisz? Hello? Pani Victoria? Chwila, bo wykładam jeszcze. Is this tarot cards? Tarot? Ona w łodzi. Ta istota z Gozdar. Tylko co ją tu przywiodło? Pani... Wykłada tarota? O, nic panu nie umknie, panie Łukaszu. Wieża. Hmm, czyli co, jakiś wysoki budynek? Może wieża radiowa? Panie Łukaszu, karty nie zawsze mówią do nas wprost. A, przepraszam? Przepraszam? W tych jest miejsce mocy. Gdzie to I'll be fluent in Polish after finishing this game. Magiczny energii. Zobaczmy. Uh, halo, halo. Witamy na antenie. Z kim mam przyjemność? Witam. Arkadiusz Szokolak z tej strony. Arkadiusz Szokolak. Witamy, panie Arku. Panie Łukasz, chciałbym zacząć od serdecznego podziękowania całej redakcji Radia Boże. Bo umilacie mi bardzo wieczory. Ja zawsze chciałem zadzwonić i wam to powiedzieć i cieszę się, że dzisiaj mam okazję. To bardzo miło nam. But the developer did 
tell me one thing about this game. If you're watching this video, you're in grave danger. But you can avoid being in danger if you hit that like button. Or else, your goat could get killed as well. So, I'm just a messenger here. So hit that like button if you don't want to get your goat killed. Let's continue. Panie Łukaszu, ja mam taką prośbę do tego fotografa, o którym Pan mówił, bo widzi Pan, ja tutaj mam źródła, które mówią o tym, że w Gostarach miało miejsce w 1863 roku. I proboszcz, jak chował powstańców, to kazał postawić pomnik Żyli. I ja nic o tym pomniku nigdzie indziej znaleźć nie mogę. I zastanawiam się, czy on istnieje w ogóle, czy nie. Um. Czy panu mógłby taką prośbę temu fotografowi przekazać, hmm. żeby on mi We can take a photo of the monument. pomnika Maybe. i miejscem przysłał? Mogę panu adres podać. Wie pan, panie Arku, ten nasz fotograf jest użytkownikiem naszego forum. Ja bezpośrednio nie mam z nim kontaktu. Ale może pan napisać do niego z taką prośbą w wątku na naszym forum. No właśnie, ja nie wiem, jak to zrobić. Hmm. E, czy ma pan dude. komputer? No, syn zostawił po sobie, ale ja nie używałem tego nigdy. Hmm. A internet? Nie wiem. No, no ja nie wiem, taki <laughs> rzecz naprawdę. Oh, this is the 90s again. To ja mam again. propozycję. Czy ja mogę do pana zadzwonić po audycji? I chętnie panu pomogę. Nie chcę kłopotu robić. Ależ skąd? To dla mnie przyjemność. To my się później dzwonimy. Dobrze? Dobra? Dobrze, to do usłyszenia w takim razie. Do usłyszenia. I dziękuję jeszcze raz za miłe słowa dla naszej redakcji. Alrighty then. Uh, I guess we are going to take a picture. The monument. Hello. Z kim mam przyjemność? Hunter 95. Okej. Okej. Ja jedno wam powiem. Tym nad lasem. Ty na powiem. Ale nie wiem, czy jesteście gotowi naprawdę. Chodzi o Gondary. Tak. Tym nad lasem. Jego źródło. Prawda może zaskoczyć. Oczywiście jeśli naszemu zajęciemu fotografowi starczy odwagi. Aha, rozumiem. Hunter 9.5, czy jest tam może z tobą osoba dorosła, z którą mógłbym porozmawiać? Alrighty then. No, dziękujemy za ten jakże ważny telefon. No, cieszę się, że w nasze śledztwo zaangażowane jest tak wiele osób. Ach, to tyle na dziś. Dziękuję wam serdecznie right. za udział. I know I don't see all of the subtitles, yeah? But I can't change anything, really. To help with that. I think it's just how the game is. Łukasz Bartyniuk. I guess it will be written in our journal. So we have to take photo of the smoke in the forest. And also that monument. Monument in the cemetery. Place of power in a clearing near the tracks. Source of smoke in the forest. Alrighty then. So we did get some response to our for our photo I didn't expect this fantastic photo thank you for your help in the investigation so we can probably confirm what Mr. Yet Shea said on a copper site I'll pass the photos to my veterinarian friend expertise may be useful but what could have caused something like this Chupacabra fits perfectly what's Chupacabra if you, know, if you guys know what Chupacabra is, comment down below. Hunts at night, attacks farm animals, literally sucks goats out.
literally sucks goats out. I think this could be it. It is said that the chupacabra is of extraterrestrial origin. So maybe it is somehow connected to those lights over Bosig Road, which was recently mentioned in the broadcast. I told you guys to tell me what the chupacabra was in the comment section. But I guess Observator just told me. <laughs> it reminds me of how in Pomeranian something similar was prowling, hunting farm animals. I remember because they wrote about it in the newspapers a few years ago. I even have the issues somewhere. I'll look and post it. Edit. Mom used it as fire starter. Sorry. Uh, damn it. Okay. I don't like the energy coming from that photo. There's more going on here than the naked eye can see. Be careful if this is the path you want to continue to follow. If photo lower 14 has the guts, then he should go see the smoke in the Gostari woods. The truth will surprise you. We will. So that's Hunter 95. Okay, we have a lot of new stuff here. There's so much reading, man. I hope you like reading simulators. Good morning, Mr. Lukash. Help me set up an account. Ah, this is that old dude that called in. So I am writing here with a request. I had during the broadcast to that person who take the photographs that Mr. Lukash mentioned. To take pictures of monument, it is supposed to be located in a cemetery near the village. Akadios Chocolak. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just reading this quickly. You can pause the video and read it if you want. I have to press back. How to start with tarot cards. I'm not gonna read this. But again, you can pause the videos. I read them. I will scroll through it. Cross. Have you seen the CAR ranking this year? So flipping stupid poles can even, I don't know, is this? This isn't relevant. So again, it's not a forum related topic. <laughs> yeah. Smoke in the forest. So this is relevant. I see that you are conducting some investigation in Gostari and I will tell you that I saw smoke or we know this. Maybe this place where the alien crashed? Maybe. Alright. Oh, I don't want to read this. But this is information that we already know from the broadcast. But let's go ahead, out and investigate. What the f was that thing outside my window? Can we get out of our main gate now? We can. <laughs> I just got an uh, a steam achievement: the cl leaving the house without closing the door. Were you born in a barn? So we have to go to the cemetery and to that that X mark with the power thingy. Let's head to the cemetery first. It should be up here. Somewhere. Pizzeria Maestro. There should be a road leading up to it. Is it this? This a road? Nope. You're supposed to pass two houses 
on our right, right side. So it must be here, right? We passed more than two houses. Yeah? I don't know. And then there's supposed to be one house on the other side of the road. But there's two here, so... I'm not sure. Is this the road? This looks more like a road to me. Where the hell is that cemetery, man? We're supposed to turn left right after. this be the cemetery, please? I have no clue where we, <laughs> where we are going. This is a cemetery. Hello? I need to find a monument in here. Guess it's a tall, tall thingy. Is that the monument? I believe it is. Let's take out our photo. I don't see shit. Yeah, that was the monument. Okay. But that was it. Nothing scary happened here. Okay. Let's run back. So yeah, it has had some tags on Steam that it was a walking simulator as well as indie and horror. So, oh, I saw the smoke over there. Was there like a tall pylon of smoke? Yeah, we can see it if we are not pointing our light at it. You can see it on the left side of the screen. So now we are going to that power thingy. Right? Then we'll head to the forest after. But that power thingy is in the forest, yeah? No, the forest is behind my home. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Am I going there? The right way? Nope. Now I'm lost. Is this where I came from? <laughs> God damn it. Okay, this is into the city. Okay. We're into the village. We'll go to that power thingy first before going to the smoke in the forest. I don't know if I'm missing anything. If there's any Polish people watching this video, comment down below what this says. Please. I don't know if we are missing anything with when we are sprinting away. We're getting out of town now. And the road should bend to the right. Hello? That's just the wind. I hope. But I also hear rustling in... in the trees. Hello? I think someone's following us. Ok, 
Yeah, the road is bending to the right. Place of power in a clearing near the tracks. Okay, I can't interact with it. There is a hand, but nothing happens when I press F on it. Do I have to take a photo of this thing? Would that make sense? Maybe. But that did not cross it off. Our journal. I have to venture in here or something behind it. I don't remember what she said about that power thingy. It seems like a bad idea. <laughs> what were we supposed to do here? trying to interact with this but nothing happens place of power place of power in a clearing near the tracks okay we ha I guess we have to go further down the road, because the tracks are down here. Mm -hmm. Can we save? No. I will end this video at some point. I don't know if we are going to finish it in one sitting. And if it doesn't save automatically, for the next video I will play this off camera. Until we get to the same point. But we're not finishing yet. We are ending this day at least. In a clearing near the tracks. I haven't found the tracks yet. Don't think anyone remembers the code to the lock. And without it I won't be able to enter. Oh no. Then how do we get to the tracks? Can you just jump over? Okay. Uh... Damn it. That sucks. Let's go over to the smoke then, I guess. But is the tracks right behind there? I don't I don't know. Let's go this way and go to the smoke. To we'll just follow uh, Follow this fence here. Should we should I think we should get over there, right? Eh? Oh that's the train station. So where are the tracks? Because I think what I thought was the track is the fence, right? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Or maybe I should have looked more around over there. Let's see if we can find 
that pile of smoke around here somewhere. We didn't really see it when we had our light on it earlier, so. Some weird noise is coming from here somewhere. We're getting closer. Is it this tree emitting that sound? Oh, look at this. The sound is coming from this tree, definitely. We we'll take a photo. Okay, so that was the place of power near the tracks. Okay, we we'll take a photo of this one as well. Okay. So that had nothing to do with that fire. No, oh, the smoke. Oh, where the hell is that smoke now? Now oh, I can't remember <laughs> which way the fence is. And I can't see the pylon of smoke anywhere. I think we are heading for the fence, I'm not sure. No, maybe not. Damn it. We are lost. <laughs> we are lost. Or I am lost. It's not your guys' fault. Lost in the woods. That's not good. These cryptids running around. Uh oh. Hey, I see lights. Let's head to the lights then. Maybe we are lucky and run into that island of smoke somewhere. I think I see it. Hello? Some smoke over there. run straight towards it I know he said that we should walk on the paths okay, we are brave right we are fright night files god damn it I like a lot of people talking it's just a party you know just some young people partying over there. And now they drove off. I guess it's just a bonfire here. I'll take a photo of it. Yep. 
Voilà. Ok, here's someone. Uh, let's get back home. And end this day. We got all the photos that we need. I guess this is a slow build up to the horror to come. I hope. Now, let's find our house. All the houses look the same, so. Uh, I did that. Is it this way? Is it this way? I don't know. I've seen this before. I think we're on the right track. it in here? I think this is it, right? Yeah. And do we go in and upload the photos? Upload. And upload. Monument upload. There we go. Can we delete any of these? No? Okay. Did uh, we also upload them? I'm not sure. Did press upload, so I can go to sleep. And hopefully it auto saves here. If it doesn't auto save here, then I will play off camera until I reach day three again for the next video. And remember, if you don't hit that like button, your goat may get killed. Thank you all for watching, until next time, bye bye.